YouTube channel again so guys in this video we will see that your Microsoft team shows black screen issue while sharing so guys if you are facing such type of errand so guys you are not alone many have users having this issue and in this video we will find some relevant way to resolve this issue okay so guys let's start so guys first of all we can follow some simple step then we are dive into some hard and some logical steps okay so guys first of all you just restart your system okay for restarting the system you can go here and you just restart your system and then you can try to open your ms team again okay then if the issue resolve okay then you also one step is done you can click on your microsoft team and you can go here and you can force stop once because by using the force stop it will be close all the applications and services running behind okay after complete close and it will be restart with the new version so maybe the screen issue will be resolved okay then after restarting then after following the basic step you can check that your same problem is happen with your web ms team or not for checking this you can open any browser and here you can search ms teams and here you can try to share your screen sorry ms team hey okay then you can log in and try to share your screen with your friend and if you're having the same problem on the web browser then maybe the problem is uh, from the back end okay if it is working here properly then we are moving to the another step okay because the problem is maybe related to the applications okay and your setting then you can make to some changes okay for making the changes first of all you can go to the settings and the settings you can go to the manage and account and here you can go to the journal section in the general section first of all you can make the theme default and comfy after that you can go downward and you can disable this option okay disable the gpu hardware acceleration okay and you also enable media logs diagnosis data for audio video and sharing you can enable this option and disable this one and then you can restart your application and check the problem is resolved or not okay so guys these are the step you can perform with your first uh, with your amazon sorry with your uh, ms team okay so guys thank you and have a nice day and subscribe our youtube channel for the further information maybe this video is very helpful for you